So Mark, we've been having a, a workshop and you've had a very good presentation here today, but uh, before that we have been fishing. So I was just wondering what do you think of the fishing here in, uh, in Trisil? Okay, so first of all, thank you very much for the invitation. Um, I've been fishing many, many years ago with Toril, the Glauma River, and uh, I was very happy to come back here uh, after nearly 17 years. Uh, so that's the first time for me that I'm here, and I really enjoyed it. And I uh, enjoyed it. Why? Because, I mean, you have a so nice country, I mean, a so wide, wild uh, stretch all over, uh, which I would say in Europe is pretty unique. Uh, so I really enjoyed it. I mean, you text us on a, a drift boat two times, and that was excellent and also due to the species, because uh, uh, as we have been fishing on the first day, this is something pretty unique to catch those white fish on dry fly. In my country, we are very much used to fish them nymph deep, about 20 meters uh, down in the lake, but it's very rare that they come onto the surface and they are not easy fish to catch. So this is really a, a challenging fish for fly fishermen. And as uh, uh, fly fishing is moving, we are very looking for new species in a way that we can catch on, on dry fly especially. So this is very great potential here for fly fishing. Uh, I've seen that it can be very tough during the hot period. Yeah. And, uh, but you know, this is also everywhere uh, the same uh, when it's hot the activity dropped quite a lot. And uh, also we can notice that uh, uh, you have not necessarily huge fish everywhere, but uh, to tell you the truth, when you have uh, big fish and a lot of fish everywhere feeding, it's not any more interesting as well for fly fishermen. So you, you should find the right amount of fish, <laughs> but not too much as well. So this is not uh, the point. And also, um, uh, of course, everybody uh, intend to speak about the big fish they have been catching, but in fact, uh, the best is to catch the right fish at the right place. Mm. And if uh, I remember fishing in the Pyrenees in France, where the fish intend to be good fish when they are even not 20 centimeters, mm. uh, so you try to make the best you can according to the capacity of the river. Yeah. And uh, maybe when you are a young fisherman, you would like, to, of course, to catch the bigger fish. But after a few years, you, it is not an issue to have necessarily a big fish. Yeah. But the issue will be to get the best of the river at that time. Yeah. And I think we have done that. The, as you were talking, I can't remember what it was uh, in your language, the, the white fish or the seek that we yeah. call it. What's the name of it? Corrigon. Yeah. Uh, I remember the first day we were out, we yeah. had some really nice takes, and they're not, we lost a few, but you also managed to land quite nice ones. Mm -hmm. uh, so, I think we managed to get the most out of the river. Absolutely. Well, I want to thank you for uh, spending some time here. And I have to, I want to say something more. I've been very much um, interested about the quality of the people here all around watching the the demos and and doing the workshop i mean you have a lot of uh, people interesting in fly fishing so and fly tying as well which is uh, which is good yeah you have a great potential so keep it and we will. make sure that everybody knows it because you will have a lot of people interested coming from south europe to visit your country we hope so, and also hope that you will be back next year for and our workshop. Also, thank you very much for all the advice, because as whenever you discover a new stretch of river, this is always very important to listen to uh, tips like what you gave me regarding how deep, how, how uh, where, uh, and, and this. Uh, you need to give this kind of information for everyone who just come here the first time. This yeah. is important. So find a way to, to let them know 
because uh, you can be very disappointed without this kind of uh, tips that you gave me. So thank you for, for that as well. You're welcome. Thank you for being here. I'm looking forward to see you next year. I will. Yeah. Thank, thank you. Thank you.